Hi students, uh, welcome back. Let us continue with the avial trees. So in the previous video, I explained about uh, what is an avial tree. The avial trees are the height balanced binary trees. And uh, what how we are going to calculate the balanced factor of any tree. So the formula is the balanced factor is equal to height of the okay height of the uh, left sub tree okay minus height of the right sub tree height of the left sub tree minus height of the right sub tree and here this bf is should be is in the range of minus 1 0 and 1 so this is a condition for avial trees so if you want to maintain the tree as a balanced uh, you have to follow this condition so if the tree is imbalanced based on the balance factor we have to perform rotations to make it as a balanced tree let me write that point also if the tree is imbalanced based on balance factor based on the balance factor we have to perform rotations we have to perform rotations to make it as balanced tree so whatever the tree that is imbalanced that you have to make it as a balanced tree to perform rotations so while performing rotations we can make it as a balanced tree so in this video i want to explain how we are going to rotate the balanced tree and making as a uh, instead of imbalance making as a balanced binary tree okay so let me take the first rotation so in this video i'll just explain the rotations and the next i'll construct the avial tree based on this rotations how we are going to rotate let's take an initial tree uh, let me take and one thing you have to remember that rotations can be done on only three nodes Rotation can be done only on tree with three nodes. So this is the standard. So suppose if your tree is having more than three nodes, just split the tree and first uh, rotate uh, by taking the three nodes. After that perform rotation again on the another three nodes. Like that you have to be done. So the rotation can be done only on the tree with three nodes. So whether the subtree or whatever the tree. So let me take the initial tree as three and two. So this is a binary tree. Now I want to insert. Let me take the fresh page. So three, two. This is a binary tree. Now I am inserting 1 to this tree. So how you will represent 3, 2, 1. Okay. So after insert, you have to check whether the tree is balanced or not. How you are going to check? You have to find out the factors. So the balance factor for this node is height of the left subtree is 2. Okay. Height of the left subtree is 2. And the right subtree is okay zero that is we'll get the two and the, here the balance factor is height of the left subtree is one and the right subtree is zero one and this is zero so here it is two so according to our condition the balance factor is always in the range of minus one zero and one if you want to make tree as a balanced okay it should be in the range of this but our tree is imbalanced tree is imbalanced because it is exceeds the one uh, one so it is a here you will get two as a balanced factor so i this node is imbalanced why this node is imbalanced this node is imbalanced because i inserted in left of left side this that is a uh, 3 this node is imbalanced why it be became imbalanced because I inserted 
where you inserted this uh, values i inserted in left of left because the one i inserted i uh, the one after inserting one it becomes the imbalanced tree because i inserted in left of left side so therefore we call it as a left left imbalanced okay left left imbalance so we have to do rotations to make it as a balanced the thing is we have to do rotation to make it as to make it as a balanced tree perform rotations on left to left because left to left is imbalanced so that's why you have to perform rotations on left to left only so this is you have to take the rotations like this rotation like this so after rotation so the rotation has to be done on whatever the tree that is imbalanced here the left left is imbalanced so you have to rotate on the left left so after rotation it is so this two come here and three will go down and one is as usual so 2 1 3 so it is in binary search tree only left side is less than the root node and right side is greater than the root node and here the balance factor is the same for 1 1 okay and 0 0 so this tree is now balanced this tree is balanced after rotation so it is also called as it is also called as left left rotation okay or you can call it as a single rotation because only we perform single rotation only the single one time rotation you have and big left left rotation or single rotation so this is a one way of uh, doing the rotation so for whatever the tree we have taken we we have perform uh, rotation on left left so in the next video i'll explain about the another rotation that is a uh, there are four types of rotations will be there left left rotation and you are having the left right rotation and uh, right right rotation and right left rotation so these are the total four rotations will be there so this is the first type of rotation so here what we are taking here whatever the node that is imbalanced we have we are performing the left left rotation why we are performing left left rotation because because of inserting the one here it is where we are inserting one here left side of left left of left so that's why the name it comes as a left left rotation or here we are performing only single rotation so that's why it is also called as single rotation thank you